Hey, this is Ken Hamrick, founder of Trace Test, here to show you some of the improvements we've made to assertions and filters in release 0.5. First, we made it really easy to add an assertion. For example, I'm going to take this HTTP node and I'm going to add an assertion for the status code. When you hover over any of the attributes, you'll see a plus for add assertion. You click that, the system's automatically going to fill in the right information to pick that one certain assertion. So if I hit add, it'll add it. I can also edit it. When I'm looking at an assertion, we have filters, and that's what drills down into which span are we going to test. We can see in the chart above, we've got one span selected. Let's say we want to test both the HTTP spans with that one test. We can delete some of these other filters. And over the right, it says, affecting one span. As soon as we get rid of this post, we're going to see that it's affecting two spans. If we look at our diagram, we can see both spans are now under test. So that's really cool. It should save you some time. We also added a wizard where you can add in, for example, we'll add back to post equals post. And now we're back to affecting one span with our assertion. We'll go ahead and save this. And we've got the beginnings of our test. So that's um, some of the improvements we made to the assertions and filters in release 0.5. Thank you.